All right, I just got back. This room is a complete mess, but I just got something off Amazon. So in my last video, I made a video talking about the C70 and the, and the good things about it and the bad things about it, blah, 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 who cares? So if you wanna watch it, it's right here. Cool, come back, done. Now, I said that the battery situation for Canon is horrendous. BPA batteries, so expensive. Really? All right. All right. That's that's turned off. Shush. That the problem is with batteries from Canon for the cinema line, the BPA30, BPA60 batteries. How expensive they are. For BPA30, they are $380 Canadian. Beaver money and a BPA60 battery is like 680 bucks. That's crazy. So to have enough batteries to shoot all day, not worry about it. You need two or three to house almost two thousand dollars and all this stuff. So I said that I'm gonna buy a knockoff battery. I, I'll put the ad right here. And I had some good reviews. It was still a risk. It was two hundred and sixty-three dollars and forty-eight cents for a knockoff battery. I bought a BPA60 knockoff, so it kind of makes sense why it was expensive. But you would think it would cost 50 bucks. Like the battery I use for my monitor. This, this right here, this F990T, I use it for my monitor. It's basically the same size, it's 7800 milliamps. This was 50 bucks. Why can't that work? Why are batteries so expensive? It's such a pull. So anyway, bought it, took two weeks to get here. I, I saw that when I was buying it, it's not a big deal. I can deal with that, cool. But when I got it, First of all, there's no tracking status, so it just said, oh, for delivery. Comes in this, right here. I noticed right away, the box was already opened. And then I'm like, all right, cool. Let's see if this battery works and how long it works. So I pulled out of the box, and this didn't even come when I pulled it out. Put that back. And it comes fucking broken. Like, the whole thing is broken and the top doesn't even work. This thing's a piece of sh Completely broken. I can see the whole inside of the whole thing. How can this tiny piece of plastic hold, what is it, like six or eight batteries in there? Look at this sticker. The sticker's peeling off too. Just this whole thing. And then of course, I put it in my camera and it didn't even work. But I'm pushing the button and it's doing nothing. Honestly, it's something I probably should do which I probably could do actually. I could probably take the bottom off and put it on this one. <laughs> Just such a waste of money to spend 260 bucks, wait two weeks, and get a battery that's broken. Like, the whole base plate broken off. I'm gonna ask for a refund. I don't want another battery. I don't want any of it. Cause if it's that brittle, even if I get a working one, it's gonna break in two weeks. So, I'm going V-mount. I will do anything but buy batteries from Canon. I'd rather spend the exact same V-mount and have triple the power and have some more weight than just have Canon batteries. I am gonna use my DC cable more often, but I can't charge a battery and film at the same time. So either I use my battery and I put it in the camera and use it, or I do DC power and just not charge my battery. I wish the C70 had the feature of where you can plug in the USB type C or the DC in and it powers the camera and charges the battery. And then when the camera's off, it just charges the battery. Why can't they do that? That would be perfect. I'd be happy with that. And if it only works on Canon batteries, then I'd buy Canon batteries. But they just put a markup on still batteries. Like this Sony battery right here, I've used this so much. I've used this and actually uh, the Desview R6 monitor a complete downpouring rain like 40 mils in two hours filming drifting there was water dripping out of the inside of the monitor and it's not waterproof this battery is not at all waterproof but it's built good I, I can drop out on the ground and it works fine but besides that I like the C70 <laughs> all right that's it also I'm wearing blue on blue don't hate me I have to actually move this one. Am I am I too short for this? Hold on.